Hi, I'm Cesar Alvarez, and I'd like to tell you about my AMI Broker and Backtesting 101 course. The idea of this course is designed for those who want to learn AMI Broker to test their trading ideas, but have very little or no programming experience in AMI Broker or any other backtesting platforms or any other programming languages. By the end of our eight weeks together, you will have the skills to code your own trading idea, run a backtest on it, and verify the results and create a trading signals from it. We will create from beginning to end a strategy with an annual compounder rate of 20%. This course is a learn at your own pace course and on your own time. All the videos and class materials are downloadable, therefore you can watch them on your own schedule. Make it your own pace to get through this course. There is no rush. I am always here to answer your questions. A little bit about myself. I've been programming and backtesting trading ideas in AMI Broker since 2001. For the last nine, for nine years, I was the director of research for Congress Research and TradingMarkets.com, where I created literally hundreds of trading strategies. I've taught AMI Broker at weekend trading seminars. I'm here to teach you the basics of AMI Broker and programming within it. Included in the course are eight approximately 45-minute downloadable pre-recorded video classes, uh, AMI Broker files from each of those classes, there will be code templates and exploration files given along the way. The class format. Each class is about 45 minutes long. Um, in the first part of the class, I will review um, the previous week's homework. Uh, then I will cover the new concepts, and then I will cover um, the next week's homework. The homework is optional, but if you're serious about learning AMI Broker and programming, it's highly suggested that you do it. You should take no more than 30 to 60 minutes, and you can always email me with questions if you run into problems. A quick class overview. Uh, class number one is AMI Broker Overview. This is where I make sure um, you know the, the basics of AMI Broker that I'm going to be focusing on. I'm focusing on the charting window, the auto analysis window, the preferences dialog. We're talking about watch list, databases, and why to have multiple ones. The help file, and believe it or not, I still look at that help file all the time. Uh, data sources. Class two is an introduction to programming. I cover the AMI Broker editor, some basics in it, some tips and tricks. Uh, programming concepts, statements, variables, functions, operators, comments, and assignment. The all-important AMI Broker function, ref, along with AMI Broker arrays. Uh, and the important AMI Broker variables, buy, sell, open, high, low, close. We'll also look, take a look at the backtesting settings dialog, how backtests work in AMI Broker, and then create a very simple two-line backtesting system. We want to backtest and review our trades. Class 3 is strategy creation. Um, in this, I'll cover new programming concepts, Boolean variables, uh, and, and, or in comparison, and the new AMI broker variables, volume, short cover, position score, buy price, sell price, and some more AMI broker functions, RSI, moving average, and position score. And then we'll start coding a momentum strategy in the class itself, and this is more as a, an example, not meant to be a tradable strategy, and then we'll do trade list checking on how to read a backtest report. Class 4, strategy verification. This is where we go with the backtest report, learning to look for our red flags and how to view previous ones. Or we'll show you some tips and tricks on how to verify your trading strategy idea has been properly coded up. And then we'll be looking at the AMI broker function sum, set position, and round lot size. Class five, we'll talk about stops. And we'll talk about the AMI broker function apply stop. And we'll look at how to add a charting indicator, your own custom charting indicator. And also the programming concepts of if and else. Class six is market timing. We'll go over the AMI broker set for it and restore price array. And we'll discuss programming uh, concept of for loops and keep building our momentum strategy along those lines. Class seven is how to use explorations to get trading signals. We'll cover the AMI broker function filter and its requisite um, other functions, add column and add string column. We'll see how to use the filter statement for debugging, how to get your results in Excel, where of course I do all my um, analysis in. And then what's the definition of best? You know, what is the best strategy? Class 8 is a final wrap up um, where I'll show you how, you know, tips and tricks on how to try to reduce the maximum drawdown of your, of your strategy, common backtesting mistakes, and other places to continue your education. As added bonuses, um, the first bonus is you get up to four hours of email and Skype access to me to ask me questions about AMI broker, homework, backtesting, or any trading subject that you would like to cover. Um, bonus number two is you get over nine hours of pre-recorded office hours. These are um, from a previous course, uh, previous class I taught, and there's lots of good information here. We go over homework, we go over just random uh, questions people have about my trading, 
lots of um, good um, topics here. Um, some people have said this is one of the best sections of the entire course. So if you are interested, click on the link and sign up now. I'm here to answer. If you have any questions, click on the contact button and I can answer any questions you may have. So sign up now.